Good morning, everyone. We are at Janice Market Grill, Royal Ross. I'm Gordy Cosfeld. We've got a cast of uh, thousands here sitting, getting ready to talk to us about girls' tennis, about volleyball, and possibly have some football players in here, too, a little bit later, Royal. That would be swell. Maybe we should start off with the huge salad we just saw put in the cooler. <laughs> they must have. Uh, that must be a party salad of some kind or something, because they just carried past two huge containers of uh, a salad and... Years worth of lettuce for me. For you, yeah, yeah, yeah. But a week's worth for some people, but a year's worth for you. But you know, come on down to Jana's Marketplace, folks. Uh, I think after the show here, I might just have a cheese steak sandwich for breakfast. Cheese steak. And do you know why I can have a cheese steak sandwich for breakfast? Because it's available for breakfast. You know, just like a cheeseburger is available for breakfast, or eggs are available for lunch. So come on down, folks. Her full menu is available every hour that she's open. You can sit out and enjoy a hot meal. You can get the hot meal to go, or she's got prepackaged wonderful, wonderful meals that are made right here in her kitchen, prepackaged and ready for you to take home or to the office, pop in the microwave, and have a, a delicious meal anywhere you want to be where there's a microwave. Earlier this week, I went to the foot doctor on Tuesday. He gave me permission to ride my bike, Royal. Wow. I celebrated because my blood sugar was low enough. I had some French toast down here at Jana's Market. Okay. Got me some of those meals to go. I had an Italian sandwich that she oh, makes. Oh, yes. I've seen those out there before. It's very good. Yeah, she's uh, had Italian sandwiches, and I think she has had club sandwiches at, the, at times, too. I'm not sure if they're everyday uh, she carries them every day or not. But, yep, yeah, no, the egg salad's good, the egg salad sandwich. And, of course, you know, my favorites are the pico tuna. And, yep. uh, but I try to, variety's my game. I don't, yeah, yeah. I don't like eating the same thing. Variety the is the spice of life. So, come on down, folks. In fact, last night before the volleyball match, I saw the head coach, the B.A. Cardinals, Chris Boffin, chomping down on a salad. And I asked her where she got it. Jana's Market Grill. Nice. That's nice. Well, thank you for uh, doing that, Coach. And she said she loves the homemade dressing. Yeah, that, I can only comment on the ranch. I That's know what Jana she makes said, it. Yeah. Uh, you know, makes it in house here. The ranch dressing and it is tasty. It's it's wonderful. She said it's incredible. Yep. So, absolutely. where do you want to start here, Royal? Well, should we uh, should we start with Grace? You want to give your backhand over to Grace then? Grace is a Grace is a veteran at this, so she is. She's uh, she's come in and join us for tennis, right? Yes. Kind of wrapped up the season uh, over the last week or so. Yes, on Thursday we had our individual sections, and okay, that was and, the end of it. <laughs> and it sounds like you guys finished pretty good um, at the end of the season. You uh, you yes. had a couple of wins, didn't you, at the end of the yeah, season? Yeah, our there? team had some she had good a strong wins. finish. Yeah, yep, and a yeah. lot of good individual wins too. That oh, helped. are any of our players all conference? <laughs> um, I think I am all conference. Yes, you are, Grace. <laughs> yes, I'm yes, you are. You are. Happy about that. Yep, you are all conference, which uh, means <laughs> wow. you're one of the top players in the conference. So, congratulations! <laughs> Thank you. That is uh, outstanding. Appreciate that's a, it. That's a great accomplishment, you know. Yes, being all conference like that. So. But your coach, you know, I talked to your coach a little bit, and uh, he felt that you guys had a good year. Um, lots of individual improvement. Uh, he commented or complimented on your great team camaraderie. What do you? Yes. Uh, is he accurate on that one, team camaraderie? I would say so, especially towards the end of the season. We started to really, like, work together a lot more instead of individually. So I think that was a great success for our team. Okay, good, good. And then he also mentioned, and I, I haven't got a chance to dig into this deeply, but he also mentioned that you're changing classes next year for tennis, whereas this year you're one double A, and your oh. section has 15 teams, and now you're going to try to go to uh, two or three classes, and they're going to have about eight teams each. So Eight teams? Oh. Eight teams each. I yeah. mean, does that mean that Mayo's in there or no? Maybe if Mayo's oh, well, he, in there. Well, he, uh, he says they don't know who idea you know, he has no idea who will Say be in. Say some prayers that Mayo is not in that section. There That'd be go. wonderful. I like that, actually. Yes, yep. Instead yep. of so, that's so a, many teams. That's a little change coming. <laughs> of course, right. Grace won't be here to enjoy it. Yeah, that is news to me, though, the yeah. whole section change. But 
Yeah, you won't be here to enjoy it, though, will you? No, I am a senior this year. Yeah. Yep. We're, uh, what are you going to do for next year? Um, I'm not sure. I know I want to go to a four-year college, but I'm, not, I'm looking between two of them. And next week I'm going on another visit, so we'll see how that goes. And it's a, in the health care Care yeah, yeah, something realm, right? medical. I'd yeah, love something, to, yeah, something healthcare related. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you think you'll it. play any uh, sports in college? Um, I don't think I'd play like for the college because I just like all the sports. So, so. no varsity, but maybe some yeah. intramural. Oh, definitely. Get to know some people and have some fun. Yes. Good. Think I, about tennis is you can play your whole life. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I highly encourage intramural sports. They're mm-hmm. a great way to get to know people and just have fun. So yeah, I'm looking forward to right. it. Even volleyball. Your wife still plays volleyball. And, and <laughs> yes. You know. yes, she does. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's good. And she's almost old. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to say that. I hope she's listening and knows that I didn't say that. Gordy didn't say it, guys. Everyone. Oh, no. These are recorded, that. aren't they? Royals. <laughs> these are recorded. Well, Grace, who's the young lady to your right here? This is Liv Glumack. See? How's Hi. that for an introduction? <laughs> yeah. So tell us a little bit about yourself. So I am a senior middle hitter captain on the BA volleyball team. Yep. So now we are making a transition here a little bit from tennis to volleyball. Folks. And she's very good. Yeah. Very good. Appreciate it. Middle hitter, huh? Yes. So for all of our listeners at home, kind of de- describe or define the middle hitter. Middle hitter. So I think it's a pretty big role on the team. Uh, blocking, mm-hmm. that's a big part of it. Being able to transition off the net and whether it's hitting tips, pushes, whatever, just being able to find those open spots on the court and communicate that with your pin hitters, okay. definitely. Pin hitter. What is a pin hitter? Whether it's the outside or the right side. Okay. Yep. In your middle. Yes. Hence. Not a pin hitter. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. Um, how's the season going so far? I think it's, for conference, it's gone pretty good. We've lost one in conference. Okay. But, Yeah. We've gone to some tournaments. I think that's definitely shown some things we can work on, and we've built off of that and definitely grown as a team. Good. So you think you got a pretty solid team this year? And I think we do. Good. Mm-hmm. Good deal. How far do you think you'll go? I think right now we could go pretty far with our team. I think our chemistry has been so good, and our team just all together has been really good, working hard, doing our parts, whether that's – on the court, off the court, in practices. I think we've all stepped up in different ways. Good. Good deal. So do you like blocking as much as you like killing the ball? You know, blocking's pretty fun, but hitting the ball is also pretty fun. (laughs) So you like them both equally. Is that what I'm hearing? Maybe hitting a little higher. Yeah. Maybe maybe a little higher. I can tell because you you got a lot of fervor in your head. (laughs) Oh, my gosh. This I keep saying on the air, I'm glad it's not my head when she hits the ball. (laughs) I don't want to get hit either, but what are you going to do next year? Any big plans? So college is undecided. I'm hoping to go into childhood education. Oh, very nice. For your college. Very nice. Yep. Somewhere probably close. Okay. I don't want to go too far. Okay. Fair enough. Fair Mm -hmm. enough. Play volleyball? Um, If the opportunity comes, definitely. Yeah. Are you thinking division three, two? Somewhere around there, yeah. Okay. Oh, I hope you do that. That'd be fun. Last night they it. swept Medford, a match we had on the radio, which people can listen to. We have a GameCast recording of it up on our website, kdhlradio.com. And with that, they have clinched at least a share of the Gopher Conference title nice. mm-hmm. with the Kenyan Wanamingo Knights. Nice. Do you play any other sports? I play basketball and softball. Okay, so mm-hmm. well-rounded. But fairly newer to those sports. Okay. Volleyball's your favorite? You want to guess what position she plays guess. in softball? Just, just take a guess. Pitcher. No. no. Okay. Yeah. That was a good guess. <laughs> well, I don't know. First baseman. First baseman. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, right. Morgan mm-hmm. Wilson, the other middle. Yep. Is the pitcher. Okay. Mm-hmm. For okay. the softball team. She's really good at it. Yes. She <laughs> She's very good. You're absolutely right. Yes. You guys should have a good spring again. Yeah, we didn't. I mean, we did lose a senior to and. But, yeah, I think we'll be able to build off of the season we left off on. Do you ever play softball, Grace? Yeah. Yeah. I mean. I play softball. I play softball with Fairbow. Is that what you mean? I don't know. I yeah. kind of missed the question. <laughs> no, that's, no, you're right. No, that's <laughs> so what position are you at? Um, I've moved around, but 
shoot, I'm trying to think why I'm, I'm forgetting. Um, outfield. I played right field. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You have a favorite position? You said you moved around. Well, you like from when I'm on varsity, I play right field, and then when I was on JV, I was like third base and third base. <laughs> And catcher sometimes. I liked catching. Sometimes catcher? Yeah, but that was a couple years ago. Okay. I was mm -hmm. a catcher. Yeah, I, I remember yep. you telling me that. I was a catcher. So. Nice. <laughs> All right. Well, let's catch up with these two young ladies. Yes, let's find out what happened to Gabby this week. Oh, hi. Uh, Gabby Temple. Yes, my name is Gabby Temple. I'm a senior. I'm one of the captains on the tennis team. Um, yeah. How do you feel about the tennis season? Um, I think... Everyone is doing so good, and it's important, like, everyone's getting along, and what matters is, like, everyone's going out there and having fun and trying their best. That and camaraderie that yeah. uh, Coach Anderson yeah. mentioned to me. Yeah, everyone's doing that, which is great. Oh, that's awesome. Do the seniors play on the banquet? Um, we yeah, we help. Like, our moms, like, have, like, a little group chat where they're talking, <laughs> and then, you know, we help, like, do everything, like... The captains, we give captains gifts, and so we make stuff, and we, like, like make a little bag and put stuff in there for the players. Okay. Captains gifts. We never okay, had that one. A, a, a going away, yeah. you know, gift, but mm -hmm. it's the person going away that gives the gift. By the yeah. way, in the volleyball match last night, the seniors sang the national anthem. Oh, awesome. And they did a great job. <laughs> Why is she covering her mouth? Well, she's <laughs> so all of a sudden, we were kind of like... Do you guys think we should do it? And then <laughs> someone talked to the person in charge of playing the music. And then we're like, is this actually happening? And then we ran over. People are handing us our, their phones with the lyrics. We're yep. like, this is happening. And there's like two or three mics. We're like, okay, we got this. Just don't laugh. Just sing. And that's how it just happened. I bet you guys did wonderful. They did wait. They did, I wish we would have recorded it. <laughs> I bet you ladies did wonderful and it went perfect. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. so. It might be part of it on that game cast. I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, Gabby, any big plans for next year? No, I'm just thinking maybe cosmetology school. That's so right. I'm thinking, yes, yep. That's right. Yeah, she could do your hair. Do I it. think that's a fine <laughs> choice. Well, my hair is pretty simple, so I think she probably wants something more challenging than that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think that's a great uh, yeah. hair choice. You, mean mm -hmm. you don't want to do guys' hairs? Um. <laughs> 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 rather do girls hair because like there's more money yeah Let's more fun too you can like talk more yeah, I, yeah there's, just, there's more money in more it. conversation yeah. i guess <laughs> that's true, that's true. um yeah the believe it or not when i was in high school i got perms oh i i got a, i got a couple of perms back in the day and my dad used to give me so much grief about it because i'm bald now right <laughs> and he'd say, you know why you're bald? Because of all them perms. Oh yeah, I was gosh. just going to say, maybe that's the reason you're bald. Well, no, <laughs> my dad was bald. That's why I'm bald. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, who is this young lady? Um, I'm Carmen Puente. I'm a junior on the tennis team. Well, welcome, Carmen. Hello. <laughs> How do you think the season went? I think it went pretty well, um, not only on like my half, but I know there's like a lot of like new players. Uh, we got two exchange students, so oh, okay. it was really nice. You know, yeah. they were very fun to talk to and stuff. Yeah. Where are they from? A Czech, Czech in Germany. Germany. Yeah. Czech and they Slovakia. both speak good English. We should get yeah. them down here. Oh, why did why couldn't they come? Oh, <laughs> well, maybe we should could have got but, them down here. But yeah, how many? Um, how many seniors are we losing? Just you two or are uh, there more? Three. We got three? one more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we got a good nucleus coming back then, don't we? Yeah. You're going to be a leader next year, aren't you? <laughs> you were probably a leader this year. So. I w yeah, I did go from JV to one dubs. I was JV last year and then okay. one dubs. Nice Gabby. Step. Gabby was my partner. I was just going to ask if you, I could tell you guys get along so well. I thought they'd be your <laughs> yeah. partners. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice step up. Congrats. Who's Thank better? You. Who's better at the net? She is. <laughs> <laughs> Fair question, though, Gordy. Fair question. She's a beast up there, man. I tell you, she just. Hey, it. Well, we gotta hear this. <laughs> um, she is like a beast up there, man. Like she just, just like she's really tall compared to me, so she's really good up there. So she just like slams it, and I'm like, yes, Corman. That's what I like to see. I'm not very good up there because they could just like 
barely put it over my head and I can't reach it. So what you're saying is she has a little aggression to her, huh? Yes, she does. She's really good. She's improved so much and never would have expected her to be my partner, but I'm glad she is. Nice. Well, that's very, very nice. cool. Mm -hmm. That's some nice, nice kind words there. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, let's go back and uh, touch on volleyball just a little bit more. So what do you have coming up now for the end of the season? So October 15th, we play at Mayor Lutheran. Okay. And then the next Rated weekend, number one in the state, by the way. Yes. Get them. Um, go get them. Yeah, the drive is something that yeah. <laughs> drive up there. Just... <laughs> That's no fun. I've done it many times. <laughs> and then we have a Chaska tournament. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you go into the sections and, yep. and stuff like Find that. Find out okay. all the information. All that. Awesome. Yep. awesome. Do you have any more home matches that uh, people can go watch? So I believe we are hosting uh, one home section game. Okay. Because we are okay. a higher seed. All right, listeners out there. So if they uh, when they get when they get to sections, I think we'll host a home section game. There they should be a top four seed. I would yeah. think. We should, uh, yeah, we should uh, have some people in the audience there cheering them on. They beat state ranked Alden Congress. So that's a feather in their cap. Nice. That was a good game. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your coach told me that. I I said what happened. She said we played the best we played all year. There was definitely some. The energy on that court was amazing. The all the. Even court, bench, everything, student section, parents, everyone was just so hype, and it just brought us up. Well, when you ladies live, when you ladies play without mistakes, you're hard to beat. It, I would have to agree with that. I mean, they are really good when they're not making hitting errors, serving errors, which were a little much last night, the serving <laughs> errors. Are you get a eight the first I'm, two. I'm betting you would be. I believe I'm a hit or miss. Last night wasn't my best, but previous games I've had around like three, four aces I saw what you on just some did of those. There. You're a hitter, and you just said you're hit or miss. <laughs> yeah, I saw just what you did there. so you're hit or miss on the serving. Yeah. Okay. I mean, yeah, I can. I mean, I would think most she's great. She's, she's good aggressive good and goes for it. I like that about. <laughs> I like yeah. that about Liv. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not a big tip guy. I like them pounding the ball. <laughs> Because they're hard to dig out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But it is fun when you go on a hitting run, and then all of a sudden you throw in a little tip. And That's true. And they're just mm, You're right, right there. there. And they just kind of stand there yep. and watch the ball land like, on the court. Oh, <laughs> next point. Yep. <laughs> I like that. So, next point. I called some golden goal for volleyball back in the day on the Internet, and they had a libero from Brazil. I can't remember her name now. But uh, she always used to tell me it was those short serves she hated. <laughs> short serves. Mm. Those are devious. Those are aggressive to get you know, out. <laughs> she said, I can pick, you can hit it as hard as you want to, I'm going to dig it out. But those short ones, she had a hard time coming up and getting. Mm -hmm. hmm. Interesting. But yeah, I can follow that. No. Well, Grace, anything else you want to wrap up this season? Because I know mention, you'll be back for another season. We didn't mention sport. that Grace <laughs> was the homecoming queen. Yes, she was. Yes. Yep. It was a great week. It we was are, uh, very fun. We're in the presence of I know royalty, royalty. <laughs> literally. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> Thank so, you. Now, that's a very cool honor, isn't it? Yes. It, was, it yeah. was super surprising. I was super excited, though. Wow. Well, mm -hmm. that's you should very be. Cool. That's yeah. forever. It, yeah, this is yes. pretty cool. <laughs> yes. You come back for your 20 year reunion. You're still the homecoming queen. You will queen. still be the homecoming queen. Yeah, the longest tradition at Faribault High School is homecoming king and queen. Okay. Who is the king? Um, Owen Voigt. He plays soccer, and he's the swimmer. captain. Isn't he a swimmer? Uh, soccer. Oh, no. I thought he was a swimmer. Do you no. know him well? or? Um, I mean, I'm friends with, like, his siblings, too. He has two okay. younger sisters, okay. and, like, I play basketball with his younger sister, and I knew him from, like, our class and stuff. Because you guys probably had to make some type of an appearance together or something, didn't you? Um, yeah. Like, originally I had walked with another... Um, he he swims, Finn Larson. Okay. Maybe so that I was like who we walked for before. And then okay. like when we were king and queen, we did a little dance in front of oh. the whole school, and that was really fun. Nice. <laughs> oh, is it recorded somewhere? I'm sure. Oh, it's I hope so. I'm, I don't know. I, I'm sure there are, uh, there's probably I have yet people to recording see it. it. <laughs> it's out there somewhere. But yeah. Well, that's really cool. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Yes, thank you. Yep. No. What do you think, Gordy? I I'm think honored. I think it's it's very cool that we've got all these ladies in here. Yeah, absolutely. it's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it. Absolutely. Let's go back to these two. Do you have any uh, sports coming up yet? Um, no, just theater. 
just a theater. And you promised that you would come back and talk to us about theater. Oh, right? I gotta, I gotta talk to Mr. Johnson about that, the director. So. Oh, come on. What's the play? Are you guys working on it now? Um, the play is the Robin Hood, right? And then. The musical SpongeBob the musical. Oh, <laughs> oh, I bet you don't seem very excited about that. Um, I'm having a positive look on it. That's I'm trying excellent. to be so positive. That's an excellent <laughs> reply. Yes. Um, That's an excellent the reply. choreographer said the dancing is going to be very good, and I love to dance, so I'm looking forward to that. Oh, cool! You you love to dance, huh? Yes, I do. Nice. So you're not a SpongeBob person? Is that what I'm? <laughs> Um, yeah, it's good. I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? Do you play any other sports or any other activities? I guess we don't need to be just sports. Um, I think for now, the only thing I have is band, you know, just like going okay. to games for pep band. What do you band, play for so band? I play the flute. Oh, okay. So you're in the pep band you just mentioned, right? Yep. 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 So well, that's got to be kind of fun though too, isn't it? Because you, you get to watch a whole bunch of different sports yet partake in an activity that you enjoy. It's. I think it's mainly like basketball, volleyball, and then football. Okay. And then I think we do one hockey game, one soccer game. I don't know why, but it's only one. <laughs> but well, Yeah, it should be more. I think Grace was trying to get me into joining basketball. <laughs> well. um, you know, it's still, it's still there, you know, still in my brain, thinking you about it. That's true. That's so true. I, I'm okay with pep band, but... <laughs> prefer not to but so, we get graded on basketball it. maybe in your future. maybe yep maybe i future. weirdly enough i did have a dream about it last night oh, <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> she's playing basketball this year folks. <laughs> in the dream you dunk the ball in the dream we were doing warm-ups <laughs> oh. <laughs> and you dunk the ball because uh, no. <laughs> yesterday we were talking about the running, so oh, yeah. yeah, so we were like running around a school or something. <laughs> it's so weird. The wind sprints. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, those are fun. <laughs> well, I would encourage you to go out for basketball. I mean, you got this year, half a year left, and then a year, you know, next year. So get mm -hmm. in as many things as you can and yeah. just enjoy it. I'll probably stick with tennis, though. <laughs> Good. Good. I'm, I like to hear that. <laughs> So, like so Gabby, how's her vertical? You said she really bangs the ball at the net. Does she jump pretty high? Is that why? No, Grace she doesn't have to jump. She just like, ah, oh, she just <laughs> swings at it. She's just so good. Like, she's really good at the net, and I'm very good at the baseline. Like, we get a lot of our points when I'm serving and she's up at the net. That's when we like get a lot of our points. So. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, I just wonder if that's why Grace asked her to come out for basketball. Oh, I don't know. She's got a good more vertical. players. <laughs> all around she's got a lot of everything yeah, okay. she's well rounded <laughs> well wow rounded. yep nice nice well good deal i look mm -hmm. forward to uh i just have a feeling you're going to come back and talk theater with oh so i'm just going to be will, an, i will make mr johnson sing. i don't know if i will be it might be like our we have like these i don't know what they're called to be honest but like for each class there's people that like yeah, represent, so I probably won't be there. It'll probably be those people. Well, send somebody, because we would I will. love to talk theater. And the musical, too. Okay. We'd love to yeah. talk that. Did we find out what this young lady's future plans are? Well, she's a junior, so do you have a future plan yet, or just waiting for next year? Uh, probably waiting till next year, kind of just letting it roll, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> well, you know, my, my life motto is, why do today what you can put off until tomorrow? <laughs> Like that. <laughs> That's my life's model. <laughs> kind of a procrastinator, huh? You're going to have to find a new partner. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> yes, sad. Yes, because she'll be in cosmetology school. Unless, of course, she wants to come back another year. Yeah, I'm, I'm a fail super, just to play with Carmen super one year. <laughs> <laughs> I got one credit left I got to take. And I'm just going to take it in the fall so I can play tennis. Yep. <laughs> That makes sense. Yeah. Can Gabby do that? <laughs> Can she do that? <laughs> In college, I had enough credits to graduate after four years, but I still had a year of bowling eligibility, so I went back for a fifth year. Well, there you go. <laughs> Why not? I think we got the okay from Gordy and Royal, so. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep, absolutely. Absolutely. Well, we've got a few minutes left. Yeah, here, we've got Roy. about four minutes. Uh, anything you ladies want to wrap up with or 
tell us about, talk about, um, ask us about, interview us. Well, you don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Gordy was a baseball player in his day. Yeah, I played oh, basketball okay. too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, so me and Gabby, we were playing, uh, we had an away game against Mayo, and we actually won doubles three. Which That's right. We Good. haven't got a point against them in like 13 years. I was yeah, going to say the yeah. state champs. Yeah, because Mayo was very, very good, right? Yes, yeah. yes. So know, that know, was, I remember that, uh, right. Coach Anderson talking about that, and that was a great win for yeah. you two. Yes. So mm-hmm. congrats. So did everybody get excited? Do you guys? Everyone Oh, yeah, was, like yeah, our they team really... jumped on us. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I remember, like, Grace was so ready to run in, but, you know, like, we have to shake their hands. Yeah. She, like, made everyone stop and then continued yeah. running. <laughs> <laughs> was it like a dog pile? Like, in the woods? <laughs> yep, yeah. they just piled, piled on us. <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome. That is awesome. That's a memory that you'll have forever. Yeah. Yep. yep. Very cool. Well, ladies, you had a very successful uh, double season in tennis, and yeah. uh, this young lady's off to a great start and season in volleyball and grace you're just all around fantastic i mean sports person (laughs) queen all around i appreciate it all conference and tennis like you said i suppose you're gonna tell me you get straight a's too or something oh i try my best i do i do jeez is there anything that you (laughs) anything you can't do (laughs) um math (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> that's right. i will be honest i'm not really straight a in that but <laughs> i try i try right. yeah well, well, you enough. don't need a lot of math to be a nurse i'm guessing yeah. uh, I don't well, know. i'll make sure that i, I don't need gonna, a lot of math. <laughs> I, I think know. there's gonna be a fair amount of math in any of the health fields i would think <laughs> but, nursing really that's why i'm trying like yeah. i'm still <laughs> you will be fine thank you, you thank you thank you yep yep i predict that oh thank you very much appreciate so. it Yep. Now we just got to figure out where you're going. Yeah. 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 You're right. We got to let these uh, people through here a little oh, bit. Oh, they're going out the back door. Oh, okay. That's okay. <laughs> Whoops. No. Yep. Folks, we're down here at Jana's Marketplace. Uh, we got our studio live. in the back. Yes, we're in the back studio at Jana's. So come on down and visit and say hi and have some great <laughs> meals. They are good food. Yep. And ladies, thank you all for coming in. I know some of you have been in multiple times this, this year, just so far. I'm going to be optimistic and say so far. <laughs> and we really appreciate that because it's thank not you. fun when it's just me and Gordy. <laughs> Royal. Well, I, mean, it's I think more, you just hurt Gordy's feelings. It's much more fun talking to the, to the uh, participants. Well, you I have, admit I, that. I have more fun too, but, <laughs> but gee. <laughs> But thanks a lot, ladies. We really appreciate it, and we hope uh, all of you will come back for your respective uh, activities and stuff for the rest of the school year. The tennis team has a banquet tomorrow. Yes, tennis team has a banquet tomorrow. Still getting uh, pizza? No, I think soup and chili. chili. Yes. okay. I tell you, that CNS wild rice soup is so good. Really? Yes. Highly recommend for anyone. (laughs) CNS wild rice. All right, I'll try it sometime. Mm -hmm. On your recommendation. There's your ad, CNS. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. My address to for payment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get a royalty or a check for that. But She'll get well, some free soup. Yep. Thanks for coming in. We really appreciate it, and we hope you'll uh, be back to carry on. Yeah, you guys have a good day. Yep. Thank good you. luck at your Thanks, banquet. Thank you. Well, Gordy, I'm going to give a little plug for uh, yeah. Trek Properties. Absolutely. Uh, I am Royal Ross with Trek Properties, formerly G&H Properties, located right in beautiful downtown Faribault, across the street from the post office in the Depot Square building. I'm a licensed realtor, and I manage homeowner associations. So that's two of our divisions. And then we also manage rental property for investors, such as you know, hundreds and hundreds of apartments. And then we have a large uh, storage rental division too. So we are we are building a bigger footprint, both uh, geographically and in services we provide. So folks, if there's anything in the real estate realm that you need help with, give us a call at Trek. Your home for-